Don't worry about the next, because it's your boy Chris with the next. Alright, so I just want to talk about the whole situation of that kid throwing that old lady in that pool. Um, like I said before, okay, when I first saw the video, I shared it on my Facebook page, and I could not believe what I was seeing. This generation has just no chill, and it's not even cool or fun anymore. It did, like, enrage me. It enraged a lot of people, you know. And first of all, you know, all I could, all those kids could have done was just ignore her, you know. Or say yes, ma'am, or sir, you know. A lot of these kids do not have home training or or respect anymore. First of all, he could have broke her hip. But when he picked her up, he fell. They both fell. So then he couldn't pick her up, so he drug her by her arm and her leg and dragged her to the pool with her two dogs still, you know, on a leash. So he didn't know if she could have swammed or not. Um, but now I'm hearing that uh, supposedly he, he didn't get kicked off the football team. I feel like that coach needs to be um, checked because it's just like th these kids, you know, there's consequences for your actions. There are consequences for your actions, and I feel like a lot of these, you know, kids get away with a lot of things. First of all, who... First of all, that girl that was beefing her up, she needs to get in trouble, too, because... Um, like, who is bold enough nowadays to place their hands on an adult? Like I said, who's bold enough to be placing their hands on an adult? You know, these kids nowadays have no chill, no respect. They don't care about being savage and unruly. You know, I could care less what race she was. Don't care if she's pink, white, orange, black, whatever. You know, because if there was a bunch of white kids and they threw that black lady, and if she was black and they threw her in the pool, of course racism would have been called. You know, like, we need to treat everybody with the same respect. First of all, where was the adult? Because how it is over 50 kids at a pool party and there's no adult supervision. They're probably playing loud music, probably acting nasty. You know, I used to go to school with a bunch of ratchet kids and they was ratcheting inside the classroom, playing ghetto music, twerking, acting all types of nasty. So she probably saw that and just went over there like, hey, I need to stop that. You know, people told her she didn't mind her own business. No, she was just being a citizen. She was doing what the parents failed to do. Because half of them are going to be parents by the age of 15, ended up pregnant, running the streets. You know, it just enraged me that a lot of these children do not have respect for any elders anymore. You know, a lot of people want to cry, you know, a foul play or whatever. No. It starts with the children. You need to teach them. You know, I don't care how new this generation gets. You know, some things just remains the same. You know, when people back then would drink, you know, if an elder came around, they would put it behind their back to show a sign of respect. And that's just drink up in your face, you know. I just feel that... Like some discipline needs to be, some discipline needs to be taken because these kids are getting bold enough to put their hands on adults and uh, and and it's usually of small situations, small stuff. You know, like because that was because a lot of people in the comment section were saying, you know, hey, that was my grandma, that little bitch, and and, <laughs> and that nigga, they would have got gassed up. You know, they they would got lit up. Their family would have been dressed in all black. Saying this is for my homies. Because you don't play that. And that's, this is from the people from the old school. You know, you don't place your hands on the elders. Especially none of mine. You know. Because <clears throat> back, cause back then, you know, it was just natural to get old. To get old and then, you know, eventually pass on. Nowadays, not a lot of people is, uh, not a lot of people is making it to old age. It's a lot of young people in the cemetery. And it's easily over stupid stuff. So that's my whole take on the situation. It's just real, real, real sad.
but the lady is okay. She um they she was on the news. She's okay, but still like this needs to be like a morning because uh, people these <laughs> like I said these kids is getting bold nowadays. All right, comments, questions, concerns, leave them in the comment section below. Till then, it's been your boy Chris with the next. Peace.